Hey, good morning, y'all. Hey, I get to say it. I just got to say it. Jesus is Lord. The devil is defeated. Thank God. Hey, the word works. Psalm 138, verse 8. I love this verse. It says, the Lord. Now, not the government, not your husband, not your wife. The Lord will, I like that word will, no chance it's not going to happen. The Lord will perfect that which concerneth me. Woo, I love that. The Lord will confect, uh, perfect that that concerns me. Now, now watch this. My body concerns me. I like being in divine health. I, I don't want to be sick. You know, I want to live a long life, live to be 120 years old and then some. But I don't want to be laying in a bed and somebody having to feed me and tend to me. I want my, that concerns me. My wife's health concerns me. Uh, you know, we've been married 52 years, but and it's getting better. We're falling in, in love again over and over because God is working on me. Now, you may not have the kind of marriage I have, and that's all right, but I want it good. I want things my way, and I found out I can have them with God. Now, I'm making me a cup of coffee this morning. Now, watch this. Uh, <clears throat> Honduran coffee, and I mix it with a little other coffee because it's too strong straight from Honduras. I like a little bit of uh, cream in it, just one uh, of uh, French vanilla cream, and I like just a touch of cinnamon in it, just a touch. Now, somebody says, why do you do that? Well, that's the way they drink it in Honduras, and I got used to it down there doing mission work, and I like it that way. I can have my coffee any way I want it, and you can have your coffee any way you want it, you see? That's the thing about when you go into Walmart, all that stuff's in there for you to purchase, but the choice is yours. Well, God put everything in the book, all of the promises in the book, which are yes and amen, is for you, but you got to purchase it. You got to purchase it with your faith because the medium of exchange to receive from God is by faith because without faith, it's impossible to please him. And he that cometh to God must believe that he is. So faith is the way to receive everything that God has provided. Watch this now. I got a little bit more of this coffee. <clears throat> I keep it out in the freezer. When I get real low, I'm going to contact my friend down in Honduras and say, bring me some coffee when you come back. Because I can get it that way by asking. The Bible says you have not because you ask not. So I ask him to get it for me, and he does. And I love it. Now watch. God's perfecting those things that concern me, just like I make my coffee the way I like it. Now get this. Several years ago now, the body of Christ began to go to the Word that says, if my people, which are called by my name, shall humble themselves and pray, I will hear from heaven and I will heal their land. We really got in on that thing <clears throat> and really said, Lord, we want some changes made. And in the last 16, 17 months, we've seen some tremendous changes made after the election of 2016. I believe they will continue. And I believe that all the yuck that's going on with the people on the left side saying, we don't like this, we don't like that. I'm believing for God to change that. I'm believing for God to perfect everything that concerns me. Now watch this. My four children and their marriages concerns me. <clears throat> all of my grandchildren, their marriages concern me. I've got all four of my kids are in ministry and five of my grandkids are. What goes on in their life concerns me because I'm a very concerned, and I don't like to use that word, happy but prayerfully involved in my children and my grandchildren's life. <clears throat> and God said that he would perfect that. So my kids can't go crazy. My wife and I stood on that uh, back when we had our little kids at home, you know. We said, no, you're not going crazy, son. No, uh-uh, you're not doing that. I'm talking about in the spirit realm because we had authority over our children. Well, we're doing the same thing with our grandchildren. I do the same thing with my body. <clears throat> Excuse me, I'm going to be a little over today, but when my body starts having a problem, I said, no, no, uh-uh, no, no, devil, no. I've already been healed. Jesus paid the price for my healing, and I'm not going to receive that in Jesus' name. That concerns me. 
when I don't feel like getting up because I'm just getting a little bit older, you know, or something. No, that my body is mine. And you said in your word, Father, that you would renew my strength like that of the eagle. And I believe God's renewing my youth and renewing my body so I can do whatever I want to, whenever I want to. And I do. I mean, I go snow skiing, water skiing, uh, hiking, whatever I want to do because my body's well. Now, I got up this morning and my <clears throat> right heel, for some reason or other, was just hurting so bad I couldn't hardly walk. I said, now that concerns me. Being able to do what I want to concerns me. I mean, I stamped that thing down the floor, and I said, Jesus healed me. By his stripes, I'm healed. My foot's healed. My body's healed. My knees don't wear out. My hips don't wear out. I don't have to have a bypass surgery on my heart. I am in perfect divine health in Jesus' name, but I won't allow it to come around and hang around. In fact, I like my coffee this way so much. Now, watch this. I carry a little package of cinnamon with me wherever I go, and, and usually Pat's got in her purse a bag full of the creamers that we like. I can do the best I can. It's not quite as good <clears throat> as what I can do at home. But since God perfects all of those things that concern me, saints, he'll do the same for you, but you got to ask him for it and receive it and believe it and get it, and i got to go, dear Lord. I believe we're on satellite television where I can take an hour a day if I want to. Hey, saints, have a great day. Remember, <clears throat> Psalm 138, verse 8. He perfects those things that concerns you. He'll change your husband. He'll change your wife. He'll change your body so that everything that concerns you is on his mind and he's working it out for your benefit. Saints, have a great day and remember all day, Jesus is Lord. Thank God the word works.